morning PE students. How are you today? I hope everyone is healthy. Today, you are going to have English. Are you ready to have English? I am Miss Lenny and I'm going to help you to do your task. Please prepare your outstanding English book, pencil, your eraser, your crayons or colored pencil. We are going to use them. Okay, can you please open your book page 18? In this page, you are going to see these things. I have dot and dots. The first one is dot. The second one is dots. Do you know what's the difference? Yes, the first one, we call it dot. Because we only have one, one dot. And the second one, we have dots with the sound of s. Because we have more than one dot. We have one, two, three. We have three dots. That's why we add the sound of s at the end of the word. So, if it is only one, we call it dot. But if it is more than one, we call it dots. Now, we are going to try to do the task. Are you ready with your colored pencil or crayons? Okay, if you are ready, let's do it together. Look at the pictures. Color the correct word. So we have to color the correct word for each picture. Now let's check the first picture. How many objects do we have in the first box? Is it only one or there are a lot? Yes, we can see that there are so many toys. So is it toy? Or toys? Yes, it is toys because we have a lot. So we call it toys. Now we have to color the box. Let's color it slowly. Color the box until it's full. You can choose any color that you like to color it. Okay. Are you done? If you are done, let's move to the next picture. What picture do you see? It is frog. How many frog do we have? Is it one? Or more than one? Is it frog or frogs? Yes, because it is only one, we call it frog. Frog. Can we color the space? You can change the color pencil or crayon to color the spaces. But Miss Lenny prefer to choose the same color. Alright, I'm done with the second one. Let's move to the next picture. How many objects do we have on the next box? Is it one? Or is it more than one? Yes, we only have one. So, what do we call it? Is it doll or dolls? Doll or dolls? That's nice because it is only one. We call it doll. Can you color it? Let's color it nicely. Okay, shall we continue with the next picture? 
How many objects do we have in this box? Do we have one object only? Or do we have more than one? Great job! We have more than one dog. So, what do we call it? Is it dog or dogs? If it is more than one, we have to call it dogs. Can we color the spaces? Let's color it. Wow, we are done with our task in page 18. But I think something is missing. What is that? Oh, we have to write down the name, the day, and the date. Let's write it together. Can you write down your name by yourself? How about the day and the date? Today is Wednesday. And the date is 14.10.2020. Let's write it. Miss Lenny will give you the example. Wednesday. And the date is fourteen dot ten dot two thousand and twenty. All right. You may pause the video so that you can complete your name, the day, and the date. Now, we are going to continue by opening our book, page 19. In this page, we have to circle the word that best completes the sentences. And then, write the word. We have to circle the word that best completes the sentences. And after that, we have to write the word in this space. Okay, are you ready? We are going to read the sentence together. Number one. Can you point at the number please? I have a blah blah blah. What do I have? Can you look at the picture? What picture is that? Let's check the word one by one. The first one. Doll. Doll. Is it a doll? Mm, can be. Let's check the other word first. The second word. Dog. Dog. Is it a dog? Yes, it is a dog. So, can we circle the second word? After that, we have to write the word to complete the sentence. Dog. Dog. Okay. Can you write it? Let's move to number two. Are you ready to read it together? Let's read it together. The blah 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 is on the log. The blah 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 is on the log. What's on the log? What is that? Let's check the word one by one. The first one, frog, frog, is it a frog? 
Yes, it is. So, let's circle it. And then we have to write it to complete the sentence. Be careful when you write it. You have to write it small. Frog. Can we continue? Let's check number three. The blah 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 is brown. The blah 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 is brown. Let's check what is brown. Let's read the first word. Boss. 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 Is it the answer? No, 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 no. How about the second one? Bok. Bok. What is bok? Is it the answer? I don't think so. How about the last word? Box. Box. Is it a box? Yes, it is. So, we have to circle it. Box. And then write the word box here. Box. Let's move to number four. The blah 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 is new the blah 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 is new what is new let's check doll doll is this doll new yes i think that's the answer let's circle it and then we have to write it If you are done, please write down your name, the day, and the date. Miss Lenny will help you with the day and the date. Wednesday. And then 14 dot 10 dot 2020 Can you write down your name, the day and the date by yourself? Let's continue by opening our book page 20. Let's read the sentences together. The fox is on the locks the fox is on the locks the fox drops the locks the fox drops the locks the boy stops the fox the boy stops the fox Let's read it one more time. The fox is on the locks. The fox drops the locks. The boy stops the fox. So, do you know the story now? Yes, it is about the fox. The fox is on the locks. But after that, he drops the locks. The locks are everywhere. Then, there is a boy who stops the fox. And finally, the fox has to tidy up all the locks. 
That is the end of the story. Now, let's see. Let's read the question together, okay? We are going to answer the question by writing the word yes or no. Yes or no. Number one. The fox is on the locks. The fox is on the locks. Do you think the fox is on the locks? Yes, it is. So, we have to write the word yes. Let's write it. Let's move to number two. The boy drops the locks. The boy drops the locks. What do you think? Do you think the boy drops the locks? No. The one who drops the locks is the fox. Yes, so we have to write the word yes or no for number two. No. Let's write it. Mm. Oh. No. Let's move to the last sentence that we have. The boy stops the fox. The boy stops the fox. Do you think the boy stops the fox? Yes, the boy stops the fox. So, we have to write the word yes. Yes. Wow, we already done with all of the questions. Now, we are going to write down our name, the day, and the date. One more time, Miss Lenny will help you with the day and the date. Today is Wednesday. And the date is 14.10.2019. Okay. You can pause this video so that you can complete the task. Wow! You did a great job in these students. You can complete all the tasks nicely. All of them are easy for you, isn't it? Alright, I think that's all for us today. We are going to see you again next time. Bye-bye, kindy students!